Back in March of 2019, my buddy Cool Trainer Ryan and I found the biggest find of Pokemon cards of all time. I'm talking about Wizards of the Coast booster boxes sealed, stacked up, cases of them, booster packs, everything you can think of from Pokemon cards, still factory sealed, lots of promo cards, you name it, throughout all the years, all of Pokemon's history. But not only that, the quick story behind it was, it was an older gentleman that owned a collectible uh, store and he had an entire basement and an entire first floor filled. He hung on to everything for like 20 to 30 years. I'm talking about Pokemon, Yu-Gi-Oh! I'm talking about um, Neopets, Hello Kitty, anything you can name of. This guy had it in that store. So we bought all the Pokemon stuff and I have the video from back then. And we're going to watch it right now, going through all of that stuff. It's pretty crazy. So sit back and relax and we're going to jump into it. I all right. <laughs> I have never watched this. So stuff. this is almost two years ago. Ryan's uh, bedtime blanket. <laughs> it's this bed blanket. And his pillow. All right, let's get, let's get, oh, let's get down to business here. The Pokemon runs deep. Me and Cool Trainer Ryan just bought out an old card store. You guys want to see what I, we got? I kind of forget. It's been so long ago now. Yeah, they want to see it, Rev. Let's go. Let's see what we got. Go. We got a whole card store. I forgot about so much of this stuff. Oh, man. Oh, look at look the at Rocket this. Booster boxes. Is it a case? I think it's a case of them. Rocket Booster Oh. Full case. And me and Ryan split Seal. everything, so that's six booster boxes in there. Team Rocket. EX Emerald. Oh, man. The EX Emerald base, base set two. two. Stop it. Oh. <laughs> More Rocket. Man, time flies. Like Discovery. <sighs> More base two. Neo Discovery. Black Look and white this. era. Plasma Blast. Hidden Legends. EX Hidden Legends. Oh, it keeps going. It keeps going. Oh, I forgot about the theme deck cases. cases. Diamond and Pearl Stormfront. A lot of this stuff we don't have anymore. I don't have a lot of, of this stuff either. We've got Power Keepers. Oh, it's the biggest Pokemon find ever. This is barely, like, we're just getting started. X and Y. Phantom Forces, Forces. Blisters. We've got Black Plasma and White Freeze. Plasma Freeze. Oh. All Blisters. Those are hard to find. Oh, it gets it's much some better. Black and White. Now. It gets much, much better. Yes, it does. Straight from the now, store. The Neo Discovery pack. Yes. Neo Discovery. Stacks. I mean... Box of just took he took the wrap off a lot of these and just opened them up and they put them out there if you guys saw this store i have more i'm gonna have more videos coming too with this stuff of, of when we actually went in the store so if you want to see that make sure you like the video and leave a comment let me know but we're just getting started with this every set base two gym heroes there's binders too oh, all the pop series look at all these hidden legends packs Hundreds and hundreds this of was one of the and this is all for greatest days of collecting and finding shop. things that I've, I've ever experienced in my life. Like years. And, and I don't think it'll shop. ever happen again. And he just has. Look at this. All Pop Series 1 sealed. Pop Series packs. Pack's got TR, just got a, a random Pop selection Series of packs. Space. Just He's just, he's just sifting packs. through them. Yep. Tons of trainer kicks. kicks. Theme deck boxes. Look, you got a Huapolis back there from the E series. Base set two. Five count. Black Star promo Articunos. We got Electabuzz. Black Star promo. We got um, the Hollows. Ryan's just pulling everything out. Hollows. I think that's Expedition Reverse Hollows. Forget that was. We got <gasps> and all he had like all the league stuff. So like anything you get from leagues, he would hang on to it. Like you can see some of that stuff there. Still in the packaging, like black and white. Those are really hard to find now. The Deoxys boxes. Um, those have a bunch of different packs from the black and white era. I don't know if they are. Man, this is crazy just like going back and seeing this again. Oh, I forgot about those. I don't think I think there's like one or two of those in PSA 10. Oh, there's all kinds of different tournament stuff. Um We got pre-release. All pre-release. He had so many pre-release packs. The guy, he was like a I don't know, not a hoarder, but like he kept a lot of stuff, but it was the good stuff. Like he would keep it sealed. All that, look at that. Those are all from tournaments, all leagues. Uh, oh, some cool, man. Like, random things. So, like, <laughs> this, uh... That is, even that's cool. Like, you don't really see that. Uh, E-Series starters, starters on there. The there's cool some of the Burger King things back there. There's, and then, like, there's just bulk everywhere. It's all uh, yeah. mint. Mint sets. Um, it's so crazy. This deck is box. A, base. Sealed. From the factory. Uh, it feels yeah. like it was so long ago, but it really wasn't. It hasn't even been two years yet. Yeah, it's and it just seems like a dream now, looking at this. All right, as they call them. Um, I wish... Oh, they got the, the, there's the binder still sealed. I used to have that one as a kid. Packs. And this stuff's all unweighed. 
Yeah, it, it, the guy, the store owner would just open a box, put it out, and people would come and buy packs. He closed the store down, I think it was 2015, so that's why he still had all a lot of this stuff left, because it was before Pokemon started taking off again. Diamond and Pearl era. Long Crimp Team Rocket. When a set would come out, I think... Oh, there's Crystal Guardians. I can't even talk. I can't even talk and react to this because it's just too crazy. Six. I mean, we're still going through this. Just guys. watching we, this again. We're probably. It was like... a lot more than what we expected. Yeah. It was a lot more. We didn't know what we were getting into. Took his word for it, and then he just started giving us stuff. Yeah. Anybody that's just joining up right now, um, we just bought out an old card shop, and this was originally live, alive on um, Instagram, I think it was. That's why it's vertical. <laughs> A lot of my old videos are the vertical. Metapods! Yo, Metapods! I forgot about those. I still have them somewhere. Pokemon figure collect. Like, out of any figures for him to keep, he kept the Metapods. KB Toy Stickers. How did he get those? Did he go to KB Toys and buy all the Metapod? Endless packs of Platinum Arceus. We have Aquapolis theme decks. We have Expedition oh, theme man. decks. The Jumbo cards over there, too. Unfortunately, no Skyrim theme decks. Yep. Theme decks. All theme um, decks from all different eras. A lot of them are really tough to find now. I didn't even know we were supposed to get you. EX era. No. Yeah, we had so many things that we didn't know we were getting and we, we got them with the buyout. Because how it works is it was just a, an agreed, like, yeah, you know, I mean, buyout and whatever he had we would get. But he was just yeah, pulling things out from the back and we didn't even know about. Nah, this is a once in a lifetime thing. We've never seen it. I went through the store and I filmed the entire store as well. So I'm going to do more videos on this as well. So this is just like the start of this. If you guys like this, I'm still like kind of blown away because I, again, I haven't seen this for like two years. Literally bought like buying out Rusty. Yeah. It's uh, just like a, a very smaller extent. <laughs> That's like buying out Rusty. TC gave me on a much smaller scale. Play mat still sealed. Like 90% of the stuff was still sealed. But look at this stuff. Stickers. I mean, the, the cool part about it is since it was a car shop, like I was saying before, Nintendo so Power these are pins. Like uh, this is Nintendo Power. Nintendo Power. Then we got yeah. a stack Box of these. Stars. It's crazy. It's endless. And the craziest find ever. This is all league stuff. stuff. So tournaments. Uh, um, you write your name on there, I think, and you sign in to, to when you go to play the game. Oh, this is a sealed case of uh, Pokemon. Uh, oh, I forgot we had that. What happened to that? <laughs> a lot of this stuff is gone now. But I still I still have a decent chunk of it. I know he still has a decent chunk of his. Look at pre-release Seedra stacked up. Yeah. I mean, it's a lot. <laughs> never never going to find that again. Never again. 99.9% .9 of card stores, they they run through their inventory, right? They go through their inventory. Some lunch. <laughs> going to go have some lunch now. Must be nice. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, this is it. There's a cool buyout. Um, like I said, I never had anything like this happen before. Still this haven't guy, since then. Like I said, own the card shop. Well, kind of something like that. There was another video, but this was still just crazy. Going to retire and you just wanted to get rid of it. So, yeah. We'll probably be posting some stuff, so keep an eye out. All right, guys. Thanks. Who's here? Food's here. <laughs> that's how it ended. Food's here. Done. Again, guys, like the, the reason why I say that that's probably not going to happen again is because 99.9% .9 of card stores what they do is they run through their inventory so you know they get the newest set in they they sell off most of it maybe they'll keep a little bit of it but what this guy did he kept cases of everything he kept pre-release promos he kept stuff sealed he kept so much stuff in the basement because what he did was he he bought the store so most stores will have to pay their rent and their utility you know everything like he still has to pay his utilities but he paid the, the store off so he didn't have rent to pay so he could afford to keep stuff and he planned it out as his retirement if you guys like this you haven't seen anything yet on some of the crazy other things that he had in his store that we ended up getting besides Pokemon. So I'm going to make this into, you know, more of a series. We'll dive back into it. This is part of the series where I dive back in time. All the video content that you guys have never seen before. We're looking at it right here, right now in the cave. So guys, if you haven't already, make sure you subscribe to the channel, like the video. And yeah, guys, that is going to be it. Hope you have a great day and I will see you on the next one.